How you doing today? Fine, thank you. I'm calling to let you know that life insurance policy rates have come down up to 50% for term life, whole life, and final expense. Now, in order to qualify, I just need to ask you one quick question. How old are you? 52. Say that again? I'm 52 years old. Great. Kindly just bear with me for a few seconds. I'm going to transfer your call to one of my specialists. Just stay on the line, please. Is that okay with you? Yes, that's fine. Say that again? Yes, that's fine. Is that fine. okay with you? Yes. I just stayed with Final Expense Insurance. How are you today? Oh, I'm just fine. Thank you. How can I help you? I'm just about your life insurance. I believe you have life insurance. Yes, I do. I can barely hear you, but this is about your, uh, let me ask you a simple question. If we offer you something better and affordable, would you possibly consider looking into it? Oh, absolutely. So, uh, what is your zip code? My zip code is 54301. And how young are you? I am 52. 52? Yes. And what is your name? My name is Carl. Carl Black. Did you say Carl Black? Yes, sir. Carl, that's all the information I require. I'm going to quickly bring a license agent from your zip code on the line and get you a free code. It would take me just five seconds. So as they answer, Carl, I'll introduce you so you don't have to repeat your information again. Carl, one last question. is just a qualifying question. I don't need your payment details, and I certainly don't need your banking details. But we offer you additional discounts if you have a check-in saving or a banking account. Do you have either one of them? Yes, I do. Okay, you qualify for a discount, Carl. Bear with me. Let me get you a discounted code. If you like it, take it further. If you don't, no obligation on you. Let me introduce you, Carl. Give me just five seconds. For quality assurance, this call may be recorded. This call may be monitored or recorded. Hello, this is Trish to Senior Care. How are you today? I'm great. Hi, Trish. This is Dave. I've got Mr. Carl Black with me. Hello, Carl this is Trish to Senior Care. Can you hear me? I think Trish cannot hear us, Carl. Let me connect you to a different For quality agent. assurance, this call may be recorded. This call may be monitored or recorded. Hello, this is Alexis with Senior Care. Hi, Alexis, this is Dave. I've got Mr. Carl Black with me. Carl is 52 years young from the state of Wisconsin. Second and saving discount applies. Can you please this call with the life insurance code? I sure can. Thank you, and you both have a nice day. Thank you. Hi, Mr. Black. My name is Alexis, and I'm with Senior Care USA. How are you doing today? I'm fine, thank you. Now we have the information on how to protect your family from the burden of funeral and burial expenses. I just have a few more questions for you and I can get you to all that information. Okay. Okay, do you use oxygen or take medications for memory loss? No, I don't. Do you receive kidney dialysis? No, not at all. Have you ever had an organ transplant or been told you have a terminal illness? No, no, I'm I'm fairly healthy. Okay, my last question for you, are you married? Not any, well, we're separated, so technically married. Okay. Bitch ran off with my best friend, 20 years since she fucking ran off on me. So I don't have to give her anything, do I? No. Very good, very good. All right, Mr. Black, what I'm going to do is I'm going to introduce you to Miss Angela Pryor. She's my licensed agent, and she's going to give you all of the information on the plans you qualify for and a free no-obligation price quote for those as well. Okay, that sounds lovely. All right, you'll hear two soft beats, and I'll introduce you to her. Great. Hello, this is Angela. 
Hi, Hi, Angela. This is Alexis. I have Mr. Carl Black on the line with us. He has shared that he is separated, and he does appear to qualify for one of our plans. Hi, Mr. Black. Angela is going to take great care of you, and you both have a wonderful day. Great. Thank you Thank so you. much. Thank you. Hi. Hi, Mr. Black. How are you doing today? I'm just fine. Thank you. Wonderful. What part of Wisconsin are you from? We live in Green Bay. Runny okay. little town, well, crap, crap nice... area. But, uh, you, you know, you live where you live. Right. Well, I think that's a, uh, Wisconsin is certainly a beautiful state. And so I'm Angela Pryor, and I'm going to be able to help you today. All calls are recorded for quality and training purposes. And here at Senior Care USA, we do two things. Our primary mission is to make sure that uh, families are not burdened by funeral expenses. And number two, we help our customers leave a nest egg or legacy for their families. And our clients have peace of mind knowing that their families won't struggle financially when they're gone. And these days, funeral homes can charge anywhere from six to $12,000, depending on the kind of funeral you choose. My Does God. that sound about right to you? Well, it sounds right to make sure that my expenses are covered. Uh, I I, I hate my family. I, I don't. I want it to be as burdensome on them as possible. To hell with my. She told you my wife ran off on me and and my bastard children. They won't even talk to me. I don't want to leave anything to any of those sons of bitches. Okay. Well, we can certainly work it out where it could go towards uh, just to cover your funeral. Is that the way you would like it? Certainly. I, if there's a way we can make it very expensive for them. I would prefer that. To hell with them. Bunch of bastards. You raise them their entire right. life, and then they all abandon you. Right. I understand that. That's uh, a lot of problem. I mean, a lot of people in this world have that problem, and I'm so sorry that that's happened. But you can make it where that it can go into your estate and then uh, uh, direct the estate to, to pay for your funeral. We can do that, or you can make it go. It can be uh, given to a friend that would take care of you that way. Okay. So, now, is your main concern just the funeral? For the most part, I mean, I don't, I've never really given any of this much thought, frankly. Well, I know that you haven't, but it's time to do, to think about it, because that's one thing that's going to happen to us. We're going to all die. Well, and, uh, you speak for yourself. Be... I intend on living forever, <laughs> goddammit. You are. Well, I hope you do live a long time, but at some point there will be a time when you have to die. So I'm well, going Jesus, to that's a bleak outlook, isn't it? Uh, telling me I'm going to die, <laughs> my word. Well, at some point you will. Let's hope you live to be 125. But, uh, you know, at some point that's all going to happen to us, unfortunately. Unless they come up with another way, and maybe they will at some point. So I'm going to prepare your quote, but first let me tell you a little bit about our company. Senior Care USA is licensed all over the country and has hundreds of thousands of customers. The Better Business Bureau rates us as extraordinary, reliable, and dependable, and for 20 years they have graded our reliability as an A+, the highest possible grade you can receive. We're one of the largest agencies in the country, and one of the reasons we've grown so quickly is that we are an independent agency, and we represent over 20 top-rated insurance companies. We represent companies like Bankers, Gerber, Equitable Life, Baltimore Life, AIG, and Mutual of Omaha. Now, have you heard of some of these companies? Yes, uh, yeah, AIG, they're the ones who uh, fucked over your country, are they not? They're the ones who bankrupted the back before, you know, when, when, when that monkey was in office. Talking about monkey and off. Uh, who the, the, who are the, you talking the, about? The, 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 that black fellow, the banana eater, uh, that was the president. Uh, what was his name? Hussein, the, the Muslim. You know what I'm talking about. The damn dirty Muslim. Okay. And so uh, 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 Trump is in office now. I don't think they've ever been bankrupt. 
bankrupt. AIG is a very good company. A lot of people have, uh, a lot of people request AIG, actually, family members do. I see. But anyway, if you don't like AIG, we can go with another one. So we have plenty of companies to choose from. You, you said you have, one so by, uh, you have one by Donald Trump. I want that one. Ed, that guy is very reliable, I think. <laughs> Donald Trump, don't we? <laughs> so, He's a, a marvelous uh, man, worked... marvelous man. A sharp dresser too. I like, I like his his suits. You know, they 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 fit his frame uh, nicely. His ties are a little long, but uh, beyond that, uh, it's a very handsome fellow. Yes. Now let me ask you something. Is it okay if I call you by Carl, oh. or would you prefer me using Mister Black? No, no. Carl is perfectly fine. Okay, now where are you from, Carl, originally? Because you have a funny, you have like an English type accent. Is that where you're from? Well, I was born on... Originally? Um, yes, yes, from Bristol. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, well, that's a nice area, too. So now... Oh, have you been? With these companies, Carl. Uh, I've been, I have not been to England. Oh. I have been to... Well, then I've how do you know it's Rome, nice? It's a shithole. I've had a lot of my relatives have gone over into that area and stayed for several years. Oh, okay. They ran away from this crap country of yours too, I see. Yeah, was, I got tricked into moving <laughs> here with my stupid wife who then ran off. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry about that, Carl, but I know that you'll probably meet someone else with your personality. Well, thank you. And now, can you hold the line a minute? I've got to go take a shit. And I, I, I can't hold it. I'm very incontinent. Hold, hold the line for a few minutes, please. Sure. She was too smiley for me. But, yeah, Carl had to shit. Hello? This is Top Health. We offer affordable health insurance from A-plus rated insurers at prices that you and your family can afford. Our nationwide PPO plans are currently accepting enrollment. For a hassle-free quote, press 2 to speak to a licensed insurance agent. Or press 9 if you're not interested. Good afternoon. My name is Precious. I'm with Top Insurance Advisors. How are you doing today? I'm fine, thank you. How are you? I'm good, thank you for asking. Are you currently looking for individual or family coverage? Um, I have uh, Medicaid, but I could always uh, potentially look at other insurances. Well, if, medic if you have Medicaid, then you should be okay with Medicaid. They should be um, giving you everything you need. Well, they don't. They don't cover some of the other things that I want, um, like additional care. Do you guys provide insurance that covers? Um, more of elective type procedures? Um, well, it depends because, um, depends on the plan. Um, do you have any pre existing medical conditions? Well, I'm, I'm you know, I'm, I'm 80 years old, so my back's a little sore, and I, I've got a, a bunion the size of an onion on my foot. Um, and uh, my, you know, my uh, things like that. Yeah, I mean, I would advise you to stay with Medicaid because they should be paying for everything. Well, I was, I was watching of uh, that. What's his name? The Wizard of Oz, that doctor on TV, that Oz. Uh, and and I was thinking, I, you know, maybe I could. Medicaid won't cover plugs for my hair. <laughs> 